Welcome to Western Kansas Wildlife Travel Center. Right here in Oakley, Kansas on I-70 at exit 76. I-70 after all is America's Main Street and we're right here on Main Street for you. Now that I'm an Oakley resident, I still come in almost every day. And I sit and listen to the conversations of the people around me. You know, the guys who are talking about the big elf they just bagged, or the folks who are taking their kid to college for the first time. People just traveling up and down the highway. Real people, just like you and me. And they find just what I find here, real people to serve them. There's history, there's scenery. We hope you'll stop and see us soon. Welcome to Oakley. This segment brought to you by the Western Kansas Wildlife Travel Center in Oakley. As birds begin heading south for the winter, Kansas has a front row seat to the migration. Cheyenne Bottoms is one of the top migrating shorebird areas in the United States. And grasslands like the Flint Hills are important stops for many birds, including the buff-breasted sandpiper and the American golden plover, as they travel to their winter homes in Argentina and Uruguay, said Nature Conservancy State Director Rob Maines. In early May, the Nature Conservancy held an organization-wide birding challenge following the success of previous year's bird surveying efforts in Virginia. Kansas Avian Programs Manager Bob Penner was one of the first to accept the challenge, organizing both skilled and novice birders on 12 locations across the state. Challenge rules required all birds must be counted within a single 24-hour period. Despite comparatively small land areas and habitats less diverse than other states such as Texas and New York, Kansas placed in the top three of each category of the challenge. One, most species at a single protected property. Two, highest total number of bird species observed. And three, highest percentage of species known to the state. Out of 22 participating states, Kansas took top honors in the final category, documenting 205 different species, or more than half of the 366 bird species known to be found in Kansas in the month of May. In total, there were about 476 different birds that called Kansas home at some point in the year, not counting the extinct species like the passenger pigeon. Cheyenne Bottoms came in second place for a single location after 126 different species were observed. Many of the locations, such as the Tallgrass Prairie National Preserve, Cheyenne Bottoms, Dingus National Area, and Smoky Valley Ranch, have a year-round public access for bird watchers, hikers, and casual observers. Summer is busy at Tarwater Farm and Home. We have just about everything you'll need for your summer projects and we're consistently competitively priced. Tarwaters can help make your grass and garden grow. And we have a huge variety of equipment to cut it. If you have a farm, Tarwaters has the products and equipment to keep it going strong. And our expanded parking lot will make it even more convenient to shop. So come see us at Tarwater Farm and Home in Topeka.